I'm Francie Deeskin with Fresh Point, and today we're going to talk about how to cook a chestnut. The best way to cook a chestnut is, just like the holiday song would imply, roasting them over an open fire. Don't have one of those? No problem. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees, and you're going to take the chestnut on the flat side, and you put a superficial excision, just like you would tomato concasse. Roast those off in the oven for 20-25 minutes until they pop open. Now the thing that you want to be careful of is if you start to hear some pings and pongs coming out of your oven, that might mean that those chestnuts are exploding and maybe you didn't get that incision quite deep enough. So make sure you cut it deep enough, all right? And be careful when you open the door because now they can escape and possibly hit you. So be careful. <laughs> Hashtag true story. Okay, so chestnuts are in season from September to January, and during these times, on the street corners of Europe, you can see chestnuts roasting an open fire. And you can get a little warm bag, and it's a great experience. Are chestnuts really a nut? Yes, they are. They're a little bit different from a nut in that they're more starchy, like a potato. But that's the right texture that you want when you've roasted them properly. Some great recipes to use for chestnuts. Try them in your holiday stuffing. Try making a soup with them. It brings a really unique and interesting texture. And my personal favorite is a Mont Blanc dessert. It's a sweetened chestnut cream mounted onto a plate and dusted with powdered sugar. So good. How do you store a chestnut? Just keep them in the fridge in a tightly covered container and they should last for two to three weeks. Remember, fresh things come from Fresh Point.